And what is up, everybody? How are we today? It is Friday, July 9th, and uh, Halloween, as far as uh, decorations and masks, has come early on my doorstep. Because uh, today, I have two new masks to put on my case to finally fill up that space because I'm OCD uh, when it comes to you know, organization and cleanliness and then having something there instead of nothing. Um, but, as you know, on one side I got uh, a bunch of Michael Myers masks. On the other, I have a Freddy, a Jason, a, a leather face. I had, and I still have it right here, but it's hanging on something else, but it's a ghost face mask. You really can't put that on a, uh, a, a little stand that uh, leather or, let's say, silicone or um, plastic you know, mask can go on. So that's just hanging at the moment. Might put that in the closet. Uh, but there's a couple places that I usually do business with when I get into the mask buying. Uh, and that's Trick or Treat Studios. And they offer... I mean, they gave you coupons. They give you heck. They gave me air fresheners. So I'll definitely be hanging these up tomorrow, or one of them. And then uh, ShatteredFX.com. They handle the silicone mask. A little bit more pricey. Um, and there's some other sites that I'm getting into, they're looking into anyways, that do payment plans, thank thankfully. Um, but uh, I went with trick or treat this time because I wasn't going crazy but uh, there, I went through a whole list I went through a lot of them actually <laughs> uh, I came across a Krampus which would be awesome to wear even during the Christmas time to put those snide little kids who's been bad in their place if not for Halloween and I think one year Krampus might be walking the streets of uh, Port Natchez um there was also some Rob Zombie uh, 31. I haven't seen the movie, but apparently it's a bunch of clowns, a bunch of bearded, homeless hobos, it looks like. Um, what else? Some icon was The Wolfman. Um, trick or Treat with the little uh, pumpkin head. Uh, Dead by Daylight. Didn't look well, you know, when it, if I'm going to do Dead by Daylight mask, it's going to be perfection uh, and speaking of perfection um, the carver mask I ordered from shattered FX should be in next week if not mailed out by next week so it's only a matter of time and I'll be presenting or having a little episode on that but I'm trying to revamp anarch anarchy of horror uh, not only this page the YouTube page the Instagram and God knows what else I can do. I'm trying to find ways, and, and believe it or not, I'm going to be going live. Um, maybe sometimes on Facebook. Definitely going to try the, the Twitch thing. You got to play, you know, explore your, you know, throw out your roots and explore your ground and, and see what works. Well, let's get down to business. I ordered two masks, and it's going right here in the bottom. And so let's start with, let's start with Iconic, shall we? When I, when I think of Iconic, I think of, golly, <sighs> you think of the Wolfman, uh, you think of Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Hyde, you think of, what was it, the Mummy? Not the, not the Brandon Fraser, but like the actual Mummy, Dracula, and there was some other uh, Dracula movie. There's just so many Iconic first timers that actually got the ball rolling for scary movies and you know even with the black and white without sound or maybe you know without words and you had the the read the caption or the subtitles you know those kind of things and i looked and it came down to uh this first version i have right here and a second version of it but i had to go with this one because this one just you know I watched uh, this movie, or, you know, if I can even remember some of it, and, uh, him being, 
I guess the with the word you could say just you know feared because everyone didn't he was different from everybody else and a lot of people thought his name was this name but it's actually his doctor his creator so let me first start off with Frankenstein yeah oh yeah has the bolts the scars I mean when you look at it, you're like man I looked at this I said that's not bad at all and it's like what 50 60 bucks so I'm like that's a video game so hair you know I can barely see myself using it probably just collecting it um, there was another version of this and it was a lot more white and purple color tint to it where this one had the green there was a wolf mask one uh, directions on how to take care of it and everything uh, but I'm gonna put it uh, on the shelf and have it there for years to come and usually I just clear out shelves I'll put them somewhere else sell them or just give them away so uh, but this is a very fine piece details I mean a lot of people like and dislike uh, trick-or-treat studios but I think they really did a good job and get it right here with this one good hairdo better than mine I always wanted black hair I don't think I like my grandfather but I would have to change everything about me <laughs> black eyebrows a little shader tan than I have right now um, but that's it Frankenstein the original horror show the man who made a monster and there were so many that spawned off of this you know the bride of Frankenstein which I, didn't, I don't think I saw that mask I might have seen uh, oh no I didn't see that one maybe they had the wig I don't know let's put this right here all right now the next one save the best for last I knew I had to have this one uh, they did not have the I have to look but they didn't have the original and I wasn't a fan of this original movie uh, it was just too Oh my god, I think it was longer than the Titanic movie. Um, but the remake, and I haven't seen the sequel, I guess, or the second one, but I guess I need to. Um, I enjoyed it. It was actually, I was like, okay, now this is a little, you know, I can see this generation being scared of. Um, but without further ado. You like clowns? <laughs> Pennywise. And I'm talking about the newest uh, one. Let's see if I can get this, lower this a little bit. But it had to be done. And I'm telling you, this mask is huge. The head space, but they have foams in it. So I could probably fit my head. I'll probably try this on later on, but right now. Excellent job. Eye holes. If anyone can do the voice, go for it. The hair. There was another one that was cheap, but the hair was plastic. It was it was just like this. It was a plastic, you know, full on part of the mask. But I had to get somewhat realistic, can I? So one with that gorgeous orange hair. I could see myself with orange hair. Of course, I'd be a ginger. <laughs> a little, a little leprechaun. I had the the skin tone for it. So, but beautiful, beautiful mask. So Pennywise and Frankenstein, uh, and then probably at the end of this, I'm going to just video tape or record anyways uh, my, my mask cases and so there you have it Pennywise and good old Frankenstein so 
if you're looking not to spend a crap load of money and you can't find it at Party City uh, Party City probably has maybe a handful maybe five kind of with my fingers five uh, decent mask the others I just go full on uh, Trick or Treat Studios uh, Spirit Halloween why am I not for thinking of that Spirit Halloween go there Spirit Halloween Trick or Treat Studios Shattered FX uh, if there's any more I'll comment it later on it but definitely Spirit Halloween props lights uh, expensive animatronics but some of them pretty cool saw one last year of a, of a demon sucking sucking the soul out of this little girl I know some people are like you need help <laughs> but it's all it's all this, this is what I love you know I love Halloween and now that July 4th is behind us I mean if you count Labor Day but to me, the next holiday is Halloween. You better believe I'll be stocking up, decorating the house a little early this year because I gotta enjoy it. I gotta enjoy it. Might even try, I don't know, maybe something here? I gotta still paint that, but I'll, I mean, it's fine for now. But maybe some lights on the top, but I don't know what because the adhesive lights that I had last time just fell off. They sucked. I'm thinking I might just buy some some good old Halloween color lights and hanging them uh, probably back there. So who knows? <laughs> uh, but that's it. Two masks. The case is full. The Myers case is full. Any other mask collecting I do, which oh gosh, now I'm thinking about the Carver and gestures. He he's put up on a shelf in the closet. Um, so that's probably. Where a carver will go, unless, well, unless I can find a place here for him. Uh, but I know I, I talked to the people down at Shattered FX about a payment plan, and they're working on it. They're working with a company trying to get a payment plan going because there is, if anything, there is one mask that <laughs> I absolutely must have. And if that day ever comes, uh, I will definitely y'all know about it but more to come uh for this page anyways far as hopefully uh putting some some gesture content i so want to so much going on right now here at the house with new windows uh people working um and just the rain uh might have to do a Jason and just walk out in the rain. <laughs> well, that's going to do it for me. I am Justin Frugier. This is the Anarchy of Horror. And if you're a fan like I am, please uh, like, subscribe, and comment. Uh, and if you have friends that are just Halloween freaks, geeks, and nerds, uh, send this link to them. But I am Justin Frugier. Thank you for watching. See you next time.